Welcome back, bearded brethren. The reigning champ is here. One one win. Literally. Welcome back to Counterpoilus. You know how it works is that we got one moderator, two people battling it out for the death. And as your reigning death. champ, oh, for, man, the I death. for the death. Uh, <laughs> I was going to win on purpose so I could die. No, you lose and die. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh. <laughs> Just blow Can't a wait. debate. <laughs> I'm excited. Well, anyways, as your reigning champ, I'm going to debate this week. And these two asshats are going to roll to see who gets to be moderator this week. Oh, and who has to luck. face... The grand champion. We know my fucking luck. So this die, get the fuck out of here. No, get that away from me. Yeah, don't put it. Ladies no. and gentlemen, the Hulk Hogan die. Dun dun dun. This thing is red and yellow, and it's full of American pride. It's ready, brother. It is. It is and my die. And a sex die, tape. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's my. It's, it's my. This die. one's got a sex tape under it. So. It's mine. I'm rolling it. Fuck you. All right, roll. Fuck. 14! Holy shit! Four. Yes! After weeks Fuck. and weeks God of battling, it. you finally get to be the moderator. I was honestly going to flood this roll and be like, ah, it's a fucking 18. M Mr. <laughs> Mr. <laughs> but that's a legit 14. That's fucking great. Mr. Shotgun, how does it feel to be the moderator after weeks and weeks and weeks of battling? I'm just glad I don't have to do fucking anything. Why are you holding a mic when we have mics, you fucking retard? <laughs> Mr. Shotgun. <laughs> you fucking idiot. <laughs> so... Boys and girls, I get to crack open my fucking debate book. Oh, dear diary. Oh, fuck, the wrong one. <laughs> <laughs> What's the debate? Today, Jimmy kissed me. Oh. Fuck you, Jimmy, you piece of shit. Fuck <laughs> you. Wait, fuck don't you we me. always kiss Jimmy? Yeah, we do kiss Jimmy. <laughs> um, I have so many. Um, well, You gotta pick one. Uh... That's the problem. Shotgun has so many debates he can't pick them, and we've been moderators so many times that we're running out of debates. This will be fun. Uh, cookout versus Hardee's. Which will kill you the most? Kill you the <laughs> most? Most, quickest, fastest? Which one's worse for you? I was, okay. about, I was about to say, they'll kill you the same. Yeah. <laughs> cookout right. versus Hardee's. Who, which one is worse for you? Okay. All right. And, and uh, now we roll... This is not a new pick. concept, you fucking idiot. I don't know why I'm confused every single fucking <laughs> week. All right. All right, 20 minute jack off section. God damn it. Yes, he's rolling low now. Four. Oh, I had a three. <laughs> wait, Shit. wait, you had a plus two to your AC? Yeah. <laughs> I rolled a four, he rolled a three. I'm going to pick um, Har uh, Hardy's versus Cookout. Which would kill you the fastest? Or uh, which one's worse for you? Is which one's one. worse and which one will kill you? I'm going to choose Hardee's. God damn it. <laughs> That's the easy one. I've got Hardee's. All right, so... Uh, now we roll to see who Beanie, gets to ro Beanie rolled for... Uh, Y'all both roll for who's going to pick uh, first or second. Six. A seven. Yeah! <laughs> You win. So yeah. you want to go first or second? Second. Second. Right. So Brownie will Brownie will go be sec going second. Man, with low cookout rolls. and Beanie. Yeah, I roll high and y'all roll low. What the fuck? Yeah, yeah right. the tides have turned. Way to go, Hulk Hogan. We're going die. to get a lottery ticket. <laughs> you rolled high this week. We're going to get a lottery ticket. Beanie will be uh, representing Hardy's run. Your reigning champ. Brownie will be representing uh, cookout. So let's go to research, research time. Let's do this. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. As you know, that is counterpointless time, so we have one moderator. Uh, which do you is even know how to moderate? We, uh, I believe it was, I'm the moderator. You shut your whore mouth. Do you even know how to moderate? You see how mean not, they are to me? Welcome back, bearded brethren and aspiring bearded friends. It's time for our debate session of this wonderful thing we like to call our podcast. So, before the uh, break of research, we had our chosen topic, which was Hardee's versus Cookout. Which one is fucking cancer? Which one is the worst? Uh, a, a for you, I guess. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> Which Beanie will kill you yeah. fastest. Beanie yeah. rolled higher. He chose Hardee's. Brownie's got cookout. Beanie rolled lower, so he goes first because he sucks. 
Are you ready? How how was the research? Did y'all do good? Yeah. Was it yeah. fun? Was it fun I, for each of you? I think I got a bunch of good stuff, boss. And boss. Uh, ready to go. Y'all called me boss last week. So. I've sucked your dick before, remember that. <laughs> he did. He did. I'll drink to that. You can't play favorites like that. Brownie wins. Yes. Oh, would you rather? <laughs> <laughs> so anyways, uh, the way we do this, we do it in three installments. First is the intro. Second is the meat and potatoes, the fucking main debate. Third is closing arguments. And then we do like a back and forth until the decision time. So the first is one minute of an intro. Beanie, you have one minute. Are you ready, sir? I'm ready. You have one minute. Ready? Go. So, Hardee's. Let's, um, let's touch base on just... You know, a couple of things about Hardee's that absolutely sucks. And uh, I'm going to get into that in the meat and potatoes of the real reason why Hardee's is horrible for you and the real reason why Hardee's is just absolutely awful and will kill you faster than cookout. Um, and uh, I'm going to take you on a journey of a little bit of what they do to their food and what they've done in the past and a couple little funny things here and there. And um, I think it'll be a writhing debate between Hardee's and Cookout. And um, Hardee's seconds. is going to come out in the end, as we all know. And it's going to basically be a bloodbath, which Hardee produces on every single one of their patties, by the way. So, But we'll delve into that later. I don't even need the rest of the time. Hmm. Okay. That was, uh... Thanks for giving me nothing to go <laughs> on. That was a whole <laughs> lot of talking. And not a lot of anything. Uh, <laughs> Brownie? <laughs> are you ready for your one minute, sir? I am ready. Cookout's on the clock. <laughs> Brownie, you've got one minute. Go. I'm representing Cookout. Fuck you. <laughs> uh... Cookouts, like, it'll kill you faster. Yeah, fuck it. But, uh, do you even really like Hardee's? Do you even really like Hardee's? Answer the question, moderator. I don't have to answer anything. Well, then you're gonna love how Hardee's nuts hit your face. <laughs> Suck on it. <laughs> Cookout has more options to kill yourself on. You can literally walk into a cookout and you have plenty more options to kill yourself than you were to walk into a Hardee's and just have fucking thick burgers. 15 huh. seconds. I don't need the rest of the time because fuck Hardee's. <laughs> cookout. It, it even tastes better while you're dying. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> This is becoming a great debate. <laughs> Y'all are uh, really killing it. I just want you to know. Um, the Probably the worst round of opening arguments ever. <laughs> Except for the joke. That was nice. That Thank was a you. good touch. Appreciate it. Um, now we're going to move into like the main segment of meat and potatoes of our debate. The hooga booga jug booga dooga. Brownie wins. <laughs> <laughs> So let's move it on uh, to the next segment. The armrests on this chair are really high. Because you wear yours like literally like... Because you have like fucking monkey arms. Yeah. Goddamn. You could star in the fucking new Planet of the Apes movie <laughs> without any fucking makeup or costume. <laughs> Take your shirt off and it's literally got the fucking ape costume. And you can stand right next to that Black Lives Matter guy with the blue vest. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that, yeah. That's really confusing. It's like why I didn't get casted. Well, it's because they don't need bald apes. <laughs> All the apes are bald. What the fuck? Are you? Start the goddamn three minutes. Three Let's minutes on the clock with for Beanie and Hardy's. Are you ready? Yes, go. All right, let's start this off with some little facts. Hardy's is literally a copy of McDonald's. Hardy's, uh, the founder, Wilbur Hardy, actually founded uh, Hardy because he saw how great McDonald's was doing and how much money they were making. And we all know how bad McDonald's is for you. Their salads are the most fattening and has the most calories on their fucking menu. Um, now, let's go into Hardy's char charcoal broiled burger. 
Now they're claiming that it's 100% Angus beef, and it's and it's they're claiming that it's pure natural and stuff like that. When in reality, it's fed through a conveyor in a conveyor in a meat processing plant that stamps the grill marks and adds food flavoring, food perfume to make it smell good, and caramelized coloring to the patty. Real? I fucking don't believe so. And which. Honestly, and honestly, all of those processes are banned in Europe and Australia. They use ammonia on the meat scrappings to and grind them up into the patty as well. And ammonia is used to make it safe for human consumption. But do you really want to eat cow eyeballs and balls and bones and intestines and stuff like that? Real meat, my ass. I mean, if that doesn't kill you alone, I don't know what the fuck will. The patties contain partially hydrogen soybean and cottonseed oil and sodium phosphates used to boost water content in the meat. McDonald's hamburgers are just McDonald's, or just hamburgers. That's an actual quote. Like, McDonald's hamburgers are even better than Hardee's hamburgers for you. Hardee's covers up their processed food with bikini babes to distract you from how horrible their patties are. As we know that Carl's Jr. is in Hardee's, which is a joint um, joint franchise, all of their advertisements are basically just bikini babes, just to you know tell you, hey, look at this hot babe, while we shovel down poison down your throat. Hardee's has literally come out with such bullshit stuff and such like fattening foods, and includes includes bisnut biscuit, which is a biscuit slash donut. That's fucking destroying your life. Ice cream burger. An ice cream that looks like a, a burger designed to trick kids into eating more dessert. Pop-Tart ice cream. Same as before. A foot-long cheeseburger. As if one cheeseburger isn't en- enough. The most American burger with hot dogs and chips on it. So fattening and so horrible for you. And they even went into the uh, retail business for... Clothing and created Hardy's boxers, which I'm sure has food processing in them as well. Thank you. That was a lot to take in. Uh, very different direction than I thought you were going to go in. But I like it. I like it. Sounds good. Yeah. 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 Uh, that's, the, that's the direction I chose. Brownie, are you ready? Yep. You ready for three minutes, sir? Yep. Uh, cookout and brownie is on the clock for three minutes. Ready? Go. Good job proving why you shouldn't go to Hardee's to kill yourself. It's gross. Cookout really grills their fresh meat and serves it to you with love. So, if I'm going in somewhere and I want to kill myself, today's my last day. I've finally decided I'm killing myself today. I'm going to walk into a cookout. And there's plenty of reasons why. Um... You have more options at a cookout. More options to kill yourself. Isn't that any, all that anybody's ever wanted is more options to kill yourself? You want to combine hot dogs, quesadillas, chicken nuggets? You can go right ahead, sir, and eat all of that on your feast to death. And um, the cookout trays are like four ninety nine. for you get one... Like, burger or one main thing you want. Two extra things. It could be a hot dog, corn dog, quesadilla, whatever. And then, like, uh, uh, a milkshake or whatever. Oh, for $4.99 for a cookout tray. That's You're saving plenty of money on your road to death. You go into a cookout wanting to commit suicide on a budget. Now, <laughs> if you ask me... Suicide's never tasted so good. <laughs> to get and and to get the highest in calories burger that Hardee's has, which is like a monster thick burger, you have to drop ten dollars plus for one combo. You can have two cookout trays for that one thing, and all that shit you get in a cookout tray combined plus the milkshake, so much more calories. Uh, and. And if you're having a death wish, you're obviously in a bad spot in your life. And you don't have that kind of money to drop for your own suicide to get a monster thick burger. You're trying to... You, you go in, I want to I wanna die. I want to fucking kill myself today. So uh, I only have like $48. 
Well, I probably won't get that with a Hardee's, but if I go into a cookout, oh yeah, you're going to feast like a king. Um, Hardee's even has healthy options, low-carb, gluten-free options. Cookout, what you see is what you are going to die over. So, uh, they even have hot dogs, which are like the worst thing for you. Hot dogs are have nitric oxide which lowers your blood pressure, whatever. What? And Hardee's just has fucking thick burgers. 20 seconds. Uh, 20 seconds? I'll save the last bit for the last bit. Uh, you, you see where I'm getting at. You go to cook out to fucking die on a budget, sir. No comment. Fuck you. <laughs> die in a fire. Two. Oh, die in a cookout. <laughs> With the assist. <laughs> the moderator is not supposed I'm to sorry, help. The moderator is not supposed to help. It was fucking there. It was a great. Two points deducted from his score. Take the scoreboard down. Two points deducted. Two points deducted from Slytherin. <laughs> so, all right, the meat and potatoes are done, ladies and gentlemen. Now we're going to move into a two-minute closing arguments between Hardee's and Cookout. So far, pretty, uh, pretty good, I guess. I mean. Uh, it's, it's, it's weird sitting here, to be honest with you. You don't know how I to don't take really, it. I don't know what to do you, with you, my hands. You don't I don't know, know to how say. to sit. <laughs> like, I'm, like, adjusting. I know, it's I different, isn't I it? I don't know what to do. Like, I want to chime in at times, like, oh, well, fuck. Oh, wait, I can't. Yeah. I have to sit quiet and just listen to you, too. Yeah, you can't say shit. Fuck me. <laughs> I love it. I'm, I want to do it forever. I will later if you pick me. Brownie wins! <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, I knew that was going to happen. <laughs> so, two minutes on the clock. Benny, are you ready to uh, give me some more long-winded debate shit for Hardee's? How, am I, how can I be long-winded when I'm ah, on whatever. a time constraint? Whatever. All right. Brownie wins! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, hit me. You ready? Yeah. Go. I think it's funny that, uh, which by the way, one note is that uh, the milkshake is actually not included in the four ninety nine. There's actually an upcharge, so mm. you were wrong in that. Mm. Um, and if you're gonna go to cookout and into Hardee's, it and you're gonna eat their food, it's a slow death, a very slow, agonizing, horrible death. If you go to cookout. You're going to have to go there for years upon years upon years and get extremely obese and then die. It's not an immediate suicide. I don't know what the fuck you're even talking about. Mm. And and Hardy's food is basically better than cookout anyways. So the slow death factor is completely irrelevant because you're going to have to go there for years. And I love it how you mentioned that um, the... uh, Hardee's has low carb options like gluten free mm-hmm. and stuff like that. Let's get into a little bit of statistics here. The burger at Cookout calories is only 375 calories. The burger at Hardee's, just the regular burger, is 820 calories. Their thick burger that they're known for is 1,340 calories. If anything's going to kill you faster, it's Hardee's. That's a fact. Debate over. Their chicken sandwich cookout. (laughs) Their chicken sandwich cookout is 262 calories. The Hardee's chicken sandwich is 370. Not a huge gap, but still more. You even said that their grilled chicken sandwich, which is on the low-carb menu diet... Uh, on Hardee's, but their cookout, the cookout grilled chicken sandwich is still 262 calories. And the grilled chicken on the Hardee's menu is 340. Low carb, my ass. Brownie wins. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Go. I'm really getting used to this. <laughs> I think the power is getting to your head. <laughs> <laughs> Brownie, are you ready to? I am ready. Two minutes on the clock. Mm-hmm. Cookout. Brownie. Ready? Go. Uh, 
He's still, you're eating way cheaper. You can get like four fucking cookout burgers for the price of one at Hardee's and uh, shove that in your face and all the extra bread and all the extra shit. Uh, more calories eventually. Uh, but, uh, and you want to attack my milkshake, sir? Hardee's only has three options for shakes. Shakes that are truly, deeply there to kill yourself. You want to die hard and fast? You want to die with meaning? But in order to do so, you need more options for shakes than just three. Cookout is working with 40 plus milkshakes. Yes, and uh, has anyone ever had a bad shake from them? I don't think so. So your delicious uh, demise is brought to you by peanut butter banana shake, peach cobbler shake, Snickers, Reese's cup shake, double chocolate shake. Uh, you name it. You can get Coke floats, cheer wine floats, and a slice of cheesecake as well. All on your pitfall of death. One minute. And as a southern gentleman, we want our deaths to really complement our heritage, don't we? Heritage well, not hate. only cookout can serve you chopped pork barbecue. You can get barbecue plates, barbecue sandwiches on for like three dollars for a pork plate. Uh, and you can combine all that barbecue with your six pounds of hot dogs you just got, 22 cookout trays, 33 shakes, all on your table, and just top it right off with a nice barbecue plate as you slowly drift into, into forever sleep and kiss everyone goodbye. At best, Hardy stays open also until 10 p.m. Has anyone tried to kill themselves before 10 p.m.? <laughs> I don't think so. Uh, uh, cookout stays open until 4 a.m. So you can go on a drinking bender and then still go to cookout and Five kill seconds. yourself with 400 pounds of burgers on the low low. <laughs> Very different tactics. Like, uh, <laughs> very entertaining, very different. Y'all have any closing arguments? Or a uh, ba ba little banter back and forth here? Hardy, hey. Hardy's will kill you faster. Heck, cook out. You eat more of it, and it, you'll also die, sir. You yeah, will also die eating more of it. And they close there, at 10. They close at fucking 10. There's I'm only gonna show so up much. To die? There's only so much that, so, that one person can eat. Hardy's gives it to you in one meal. I'm you don't have to buy up. 400 burgers. Mm. Hardy's is like, here's one meal of poison death for you, and have fun and enjoy your mm. demise. Yeah, but you can't top it off with 40 plus shakes. I'm sorry, sir. No, 40, 40 mi plus milkshakes, I'll give it to you. But who comes up with a an ice cream burger? Trying to trick innocent children into eating more desserts. Pop tart ice cream sandwich? Are you kidding me? If you're really dedicated on killing yourself in a Hardee's, you gotta show up early. You you can show up at a at a cookout just on on a whim. What, honey? No, don't break up with me. N no, oh no, she broke up with me. Cookout still open until 4 a.m. I'm on my way. <laughs> you can fucking eat yourself to death. Have you ever been to, uh, yeah, Cookout has the night shift. I'll give you that. But Hardee's has the morning shift. Every single time that I pass by a Hardee's in the morning, they're always packed out for breakfast. Always packed out for breakfast. Cookout doesn't have any breakfast food. Uh, um, I don't know if you noticed, but if you're on a kill yourself depression spree, you don't wake up early. <laughs> no, obviously not. <laughs> you're not. <laughs> you stay up late. See, your focus is so hell-bent on suicide. <laughs> yes! How, how are you going to go into a cookout and immediately commit suicide that same day? <laughs> I'll find a fucking way, sir. <laughs> You're just going to eat until you get full and puke, and that's it. And cry. And, and then call, continue And eating. call her back. Ask her, ask for her hand in marriage, and like start jumping the gun way too much. Oh, I'll have babies with you, bro. No, don't leave me, no. And then go right back to the fucking forty more milkshakes. Forty more milkshakes. Yeah, Hard. Bro. Well, what are you gonna do about dinner, lunch, breakfast? You're gonna go to Hardee's. The only way, the only way you're gonna get them to go to cookout is at three in the morning when his wife left him for the pool boy who's been staring at her for you know years while you're at work. 
Um, He's going to wake up and go to breakfast at Hardee's and get a big old damn sausage, egg, and cheese biscuit and feel fucking amazing about himself and have a heart attack on the way back to fucking cookout to finish him off with some milkshake. Well, that's the fucking problem. He shouldn't be feeling good about himself. He's trying to fucking die. What a fucking quitter. He's trying to... <laughs> Hardee's will kill you when you least expect it. So, Har Hardy's is that restaurant that will kill you when you least expect it. Hardy's is not a suicide restaurant. They're, you're going to go there trying to feel good. I don't know. Um, in my experience, the only people I see at Hardy are old people, which that means they've been eating it for years and they have longevity in their life. <laughs> yeah, it you never see old people at cookouts. <laughs> it's like young people trying to kill themselves. Yeah. That's just demographic. Hardy's um, probably mutates them to some kind of like superhuman because their bodies have ingested that filth all their life. Going on what he's talking about, the instant I'm trying to go there and kill myself. Suicide today. <laughs> Y'all <Yeah>. uh, <laughs> could have brought up service. <laughs> Hardy service. You're going to have to wait for fucking hours just to die. <laughs> just forget help. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. <laughs> Cookout's pretty quick. Yeah, get it right there. <laughs> so, uh, I like the fact that you brought up actual like nutritional facts. And the calorie counts and stuff like That's that. That's why I went this direction. Yeah, uh, yeah. <laughs> I looked at fucking... it. It was like, mother of God, <laughs> I've got to write jokes. That's <laughs> fucking insane. Uh, I know. That's why I knew I was gonna win with you. Fucking did touch calorie on breakfast count. a little bit, like because you can kill yourself with Hardy's breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Yeah. But open till four a.m. That's still you can still accomplish three meals. You know, fucking lunch, dinner. After dinner. Fucking yeah. 90% of the world is asleep by like midnight. Yeah. So you're, so technically cookout's only killing like 10% of the world. Yeah. Hardy's the has the people. rest of the fucking percentage going on. I do on. like cookout more than I do Hardy's. Yeah. I, I, I'll get a Hardy's biscuit every now and then. You know, bacon, egg, and cheese is pretty good. They're fucking country uh, fried steak or mm -hmm. that uh, shit's good. Yeah. Um, cookout to me, like. I went there for the first time, I believe last year, with uh, our other company. Yeah. And I've never been, so I walk in yeah. not knowing what to expect, and they've got that meal, the four ninety nine fucking meal, and it's like, you can have a burger or a hot dog. Okay, cool. What kind of burger do you want, and what, what do you want on it? Here's a whole fucking list of yeah. shit you want on it. Yeah. Okay? Then... You want fries or onion rings? Hmm, okay, I'll get fries. Okay, well, guess what? We're not done. Yeah. You, you get, get a more. drink. Cool. Oh, oh and you and can we're get not done. Uh, yeah, we're not done. Here's two extra items. Yeah. You can also get those onion rings that you wanted before. And do you want a quesadilla? <laughs> yeah. We're at a burger joint. Do you want a quesadilla? Do you want a the fucking answer's chicken always wrap? Yes. Do you want... I'm like... I'm like... This is like my place. Mm -hmm. Like, I don't... I'm, yeah. Yes, I want a quesadilla. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, by the time that you get done deciding, you could have just ordered a thick burger at Hardee's and just died on the spot. That's just a lot of burger to eat. And, <laughs> yeah. Like, I may be fat, but, like, eating something for a long period of time, I get bored and I'll end up eventually just stop eating it because <laughs> I'm li I may be starving still, but I'm just like... I'm eating the same fucking thing over and over. Yeah. <laughs> Every bite's the same shit. Uh, yeah, it's an agonizing, painful death. Uh, I like the jokes you were throwing in. I like uh, you hit me where I'm, where I am. You hit me in the core where it was budget. Yeah, and I was like, wow, that's fucking. <laughs> <laughs> if I'm gonna kill myself, it's suicide on a budget. Yeah. That's yeah. fucking yeah. going with the cheap nylon rope at fucking Home Depot, not the and expensive party, kind. Yeah. And you can get a cheap barbecue sandwich, which is pretty fucking um, good. And, and if I am gonna kill myself, I'm gonna go out with something tasty, which is cookout. Um, with I'm a diabetic much with milkshakes. <laughs> you fucking, yeah. I, I would die. <laughs> <laughs> with all yeah. the 40 versions of milkshake. Yeah. Um, it, this is a tough one because both of you, like, Hardee's is legitimately worse than Cookout, I feel like. But, Hardee's will kill you faster. But Brownie killed it with the debate this time. And with the, his style and what he did, I, I, Brownie's the winner. Yeah, another joke this time. Bitches. All right, fine. It's like my second win. I mean, Hardy's is fucking worse. That was the debate. But which is no, no, worse? No. Which is going it's, to kill you faster? But 
The debate is who can deliver their facts. You did pretty well, but who Brown d- fucking, d- fucking hit me with facts. a southern gentleman. He hit me with all the fucking topics. He hit me with catchy fucking taglines. He fucking brought me in with like a story of like fucking breaking up and you're going to go to cookout at four in the morning. Hit me with like a budget. Like you pay $10 for one burger there. You can get fucking 12 things here. <laughs> And I'm just like, you know, I, I oh just... shit! I had this one funny fact that I forgot to mention. Throw it at me. You already lost. Okay, Wilbur Hardy, Wilbur Hardy, the founder, yeah, lost his control of the company in a card game. <laughs> <laughs> Legitimately, he was playing with what this. He was playing idiot. with his other two par- other two partners in a card game. Got drunk and lost. His control, so his other two partners He's had like, 51%. Yeah, well, I bet my shares of the company. All right. Yeah. Fuck, I had two twos. I was, yeah. was kind of hoping, because I glanced over and I saw you wrote on the top of your sheet, attacking my milkshakes, huh? Yeah. I was hoping you were going to say, attacking my milkshakes? Will they bring all the boys to the yard <laughs> to commit suicide <laughs> at cookout? Like, I would have been like... Fucking goddamn over. Uh, yeah, I, it was. It all went down to the way the facts were delivered in the debate. Brownie just out debated you this time. You uh, had more facts and fine, whatever. But the shit they came up with, like the bis nut, fucking biscuit, fucking donut. Are you kidding me? Uh, that sounds awful. If yeah. that, if that's, if that's <laughs> now, is it just two burger? donuts with a biscuit in the middle? Because like, doesn't Dunkin' and all that do that now? Or like. Dunkin' Donuts, like, I felt like a, yeah, someone's done that. No, it's literally a biscuit with just, like, chocolate drizzle on it. Oh, yeah. that's awful. Yeah, and they, like, merged, like, a biscuit flavor and a donut no, flavor. No, when, when you picked Hardee's, I was just sitting here like, please don't pick Hardee's. Please just be an idiot and pick Cookout. <laughs> so, like... You you played it smart. You played it smart. That was the I'll only option I really had. <laughs> if I tried to hit, hit you with facts, I would just be dominated because I looked up the calorie counts like versus each other and i was like oh yeah cookout wins no <laughs> none of these like hardy every oh, yeah. hardy's smallest burger still has more calories than fucking uh cookout's biggest burger <coughs> no no it wasn't biggest it was their smallest burger well brownie won this debate he is the champion he will be moving on next week to debate me or uh beanie yeah, fuck so you. that is the end of our debate counterpointless let's move on to another segment ladies and gentlemen and you let us know in the comments of who won